Hi, Brett Ridgway here with 50BiggestWebsiteMistakes.com and today's mistake number 45 titled Legally Speaking. This mistake is pretty common across most websites on the web today. We know we've gotten in a hurry ourselves and made this mistake, but it's critical to be sure not to make this mistake and it's easily remedied. What we're talking about here is the required legal mumbo jumbo on our websites. Not only is it a good suggestion, but in many cases it's required by your merchant account and in the United States, the Federal Trade Commission. Let's get a little more specific about what we're talking about. You should make it a common practice to add the correct notifications about your privacy policy, earnings disclaimer, and terms of service. It's also a good idea to add your business contact information. The privacy policy helps build trust with your website visitors and shows that you're a professional and trustworthy organization. This policy should state things about what information you collect, how the information is used or not used, how you protect the information you do collect, and things such as that. The earnings disclaimer should spell out in detail that you do not guarantee that your product or service will give them a set level of income and that you accurately state what is possible or if income is possible. Terms of service simply states what your acceptable use policies are for your products and how they are handled as well as what's allowed and not allowed for your products, services, or information. As for the contact information, you should at least put your physical location for your business and a way to contact you or a member of your company. A good way to handle that is either via a contact form or a link to your support system. By using that method, you tend to cut down on subjecting that email address to unnecessary incoming email. You can find many resources for this online by searching for each term in Google, followed by template or generator such as privacy policy template or terms of service generator. A product that we use and recommend is autoweblaw.com, which is A-U-T-O-W-E-B-L-A-W.com that will create all the documentation you need for your website. As for the placement of these documents, it's best to have them in the footer as links at the very bottom of your web page. Be sure to have them open as a size pop-up window so that it doesn't deter from the sale or distract the visitor by causing them to try to find out how to get back to your website. For other great website tips, please visit our site at 50biggestwebsitemistakes.com.